Hi everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. For this video, I'm going to be showing you guys everything I do for back to school. So like a back to school prep, I'm going to be showing you guys all the shopping I'm going to do. And I'm also going to be showing you guys how I set up my laptop and how I set up my iPad for back to school. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I just got my Urban Planet package. So one of the things that goes to my shopping haul for back to school, but I didn't get it in store. I got it online. So I'm going to do a try on haul and I'll let you guys know how if it's my first cargo jeans I love. They're the cargo jeans from Urban Planet. I got them in a size 5 and my waist is a size 25.5, uh, 26.5. But I love them so much. I'm literally obsessed. No, because I'm literally obsessed. Like this is, I don't know why I've been obsessed with matching sets recently. But these are perfect for back to school. And I feel like I've been shopping so long for back to school and these matching sets are super cute. And honestly, they're a dupe for the white fox ones. Even if the white fox ones, like the design is different, these are still super cute. And I think they're like, 50, it was $15.99 for this shirt, $15.99 for the pants. But guys, you can't say this is not adorable. This is the second sweatsuit I am in love i'm full on in love i forgot to mention but i got both of these in a size small top and bottom and they fit me perfectly not too oversized but again not too tight and i feel like it was an extra small but me personally with my measurements again i'm a size 26.5 waist and i have really like long legs but i honestly feel like a size small is perfect and it fits I love. So I just got to the mall that I'm gonna be shopping at. It's 12:51, so I'm planning to leave here around three o'clock since my boyfriend has a physio appointment. But I'm gonna show you guys when I'm in the store. But this mall usually gets super super busy, so hopefully I can record in store. If not, I'm gonna show you guys a haul at the end of everything I got. Okay, so I'm walking to Sephora right now. He's shy with me holding the camera in public, but like I literally could not care less. I just left uh, Sephora. I literally couldn't even like put in store because my boyfriend was so embarrassed of me. But I got the U perfume and I also got the House of uh, I forgot what it's called. But I got a, a lip thing. I'm gonna show you guys one, once I get into a car, a full haul of everything. Okay, so I just left Garage. I bought this shirt that I showed in the last clip. It's super cute. I've been eyeing it for the longest time. So I'm happy I bought that. So I finished shopping for the day. Now my friends are coming soon, so I'm gonna record once they get here. Say hi to the camera. Hello. That's our cameraman. Guys, I literally don't know if I should buy the TNA Butter Cheeky Ankle and Small in this color. I bought them in black this morning, but I don't know if I should get them in this color. I don't know. I'm out of right here right now because my boyfriend is too comfortable in the boyfriend area. So I don't know if I should get these pants. I'm still thinking guys. I just got back from the mall. It was so busy, so I barely recorded inside. So, let me start with the haul. So, first I went to Sephora, of course. I got the Grown Alchemist Lip Balm. It's in uh, the flavor or whatever 
vanilla watermelon I love it I've been trying it for like the longest time and I feel like it's the only lip balm that actually works I have so many but I feel like none of them work as this one works and then I got the you um, glossier perfume I tried it in New York and I really really liked it but then I tried it again in store but it didn't smell the same so I don't know. hopefully I like it my boyfriend said he does not like it so I don't know but hopefully hopefully I don't know hopefully I end up liking it after next I got this Brooklyn top from garage I love it so much like it's super cute it reminds me of like varsity I don't know like I love it I find it so cute with like leggings and Uggs I actually was supposed to buy Uggs but I didn't end up buying them but the next time I go shopping, I will buy them. Okay guys, so I just wanted to show you how I edit my iPad for back to school. So this is my wallpaper. Sorry, close on me. But this is my wallpaper. I love doing it. I find it so aesthetic. So these are the widgets I put. God's plan is worth the right way. I find that super cute. I edited this to look like that again with the camera I made it uh, so that you could see my battery charge a new era of me and I also made the apps in the bigger form so now let's go to my good notes so I could show you that so as you could see on my good notes I have a 2023 planner which I downloaded and then see so I go here and it shows me the planner at first, it was basically each day, like it showed each day, but I didn't want that. So I just changed it to the week. So as you can see now, it's a weekly planner. It included the weekly planner, but also a daily planner. But I didn't want to put a daily planner since I know that if I would put a daily planner, I wouldn't use it because I feel like daily planners are too much. And so then here, look, you could see I have my calendar. I also have a calendar again and then a weekly planner so this is for this week and then I have every week after that till January so next I'm going to be showing you guys my how I do my notebook so as you can see I have all my classes philosophy of religion elementary school math all of these I have each as you can see, I made my own covers. So if you want, I could show you guys how I do my covers in another video. But it's super easy. I get my covers from Pinterest. And then I just do change template. And then I do cover. And then I change it from there. I just do edit and then import from my camera roll. Moving on to how I edit my laptop so as you can see here i have my visual planner this is my visual planner for 2023 and guys when i tell you most of this came true like if i have one life hack for you is to do a visual planner and put it on your phone as you can see i also have it on my phone it's the same one but literally guys most of these things came true and now that's really something that i'm going to do every single year so for 2024 i'm going to do another one 2025 here i did working out even though like i stopped working out i still really was focused on working out at the beginning of 2023 eating healthier youtube and i started youtube which is something that i didn't think that i would do also I have another video of YouTube as you can see here content creating road trips which I did clear skin which actually my skin did clear up clear up in 2023 vacation and I vacationed twice this summer which is something very very rare Pilates which I ended up doing with my friend money skincare this did not happen yet but hopefully it happens soon Okay, so I zoomed in to show you guys how I um, edit my and how I organize my school classes. 
so these are the ones for my last semesters okay this is youtube but for fall 2022 i'll click on it so you guys can see so again i put all my classes here and so i put all my assignments everything for the class i organize it in this file again 2023 all my classes i keep it just in case i need it again but if you don't have to keep it if you don't want to again every all my assignments and because i got an ipad i will be taking notes on my ipad but when it comes to assignments i'm still gonna do them on my laptop so again so this is the one for fall 2023 this is my fall 2023 semester classes so i'm gonna be putting all of my assignments for each class in their own category so everything for philosophy of religion i'm gonna be putting it in this file for elementary school math i'm gonna be putting it in this file so everything is really organized and i never lose any of my assignments i know some of you are gonna ask where i get these cute covers for my files so the hearts and also this i get it from this other youtuber's channel julia k christ and she has them right here so i'm gonna show you so she has all kinds of uh freebies so i usually check her folder icons and she has how you guys should do it here she has the instructions for that and then she also has all these cute little folder covers that are not the original ones and they're super 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 cute so like for my winter semester i usually choose these ones the snowflake or the christmas tree so i usually use this for every semester depending on if it's fall winter and i find them super cute and aesthetic so that's it for organizing my ipad and my laptop for back to school i hope you guys learned a bit i know i didn't show in depth but I feel like a lot of people already do this on their own laptop and iPad. But if ever you guys want me to go more into detail on how I do icon covers and like the the file covers, please let me know. I really don't mind doing like a more in-depth video. But again, I hope you guys learned something good out of it. That's it for this video. I hope all of you enjoyed the shopping haul. And I know most of the stuff were bought online because... I went to the store and there was almost nothing there but i'm gonna be showing you guys a haul once i get everything on tiktok and then maybe youtube but i've been posting a lot of hauls recently and i also hope that all of you enjoyed the laptop and the ipad um organization video and that's it for this video i hope all of you guys enjoyed once again and stay tuned for my next video. Bye, guys. I contemplate how I